getting vitamin D3 from the sun versus getting it from supplementation. So a couple downsides and why we're not getting an adequate amount of vitamin D3 from the sun currently is that it takes typically a full body sun exposure 15 to 30 minutes every single day. So standing in the sun naked for you to have enough vitamin D3 to be even. But regardless of that, our lifestyle typically is having us be inside. So at the end of the day, we kind of don't have a choice. We have to use supplementation. The average American is gonna need about 2,000 international units per day. And if you're trying to increase your vitamin D, you're gonna be more at like 5,000 to 10,000 international units per day. The normal medical range is between 30 nanograms per milliliter and 100 nanograms per milliliter. If you exceed 100, you can be in this toxic range, which has all sorts of inflammatory issues that go along with it. So make sure you stay in the good range. And if you have any questions, please reach out to me. I'm happy to help.